Hi, this is uh, Dennis Hawkins in Japan, and we're going to look at the phases of creating a Google Docs slide presentation. Just follow along, and this is phase one. In following YouTube videos, you will also see the next phases as this develops into a finished product. Now, if you do not know how to construct the slides for a Google slide presentation, then you need to research some other YouTube videos on how to uh, set up your Google Slides. So let's assume that you've already done that, and now we're going to go through the fundamentals of what you're going to do when you first enter the number one phase of this project. So what you want to do first is just enter your text data, all right, and get it centered, right, and keep each slide consistent according to the main topic. Now this is my title and this is my subtitle. Then we're going to move into the next slide. Take note that I'm going to place this information right on this line here, and this is going to be another uh, kind of a title here. I keep this all blank here. Later on, you will discover in other phases what I'm going to use this empty space for. All right, let's just go through all our slides as they look uh, to us at this particular stage. Okay, again, I keep this line right here. Okay, now I moved it down over here because it's a longer one. I could have split this. It's your choice. Okay, now I've got it down on this line here. Okay, same line here. This whole uh, part here is called customer concerns. All right, keeping it on the same line, same line here, same line here. Now, this is the next part of the uh, presentation. It's the business builder concerns, right? And I'm gonna place that information on this line just underneath here. And let's see if I stay consistent with that. Okay, yes, yeah, same line. Again, same line. Same line here with some additional information. I have to keep this space open because later on I will have myself in the screen down here. Okay, now I've moved it back up here. And I'm holding that space right here and then I've got another line I'll add here. Okay, same case, same line, more information here. All right, same line, last slide. I'm going to uh, enlarge this uh, information, okay? Then I'm going to go to my close, which is connect with me on Facebook. And I'll put my Facebook information in the description of the video, okay? And then I'll ask the person to send me a friend request and also a message saying, saw your video, because we get lots of friend requests, right? We want to know who saw our video. You know, go in there and check their profile. If uh, they look like somebody we want to connect with, then we'll accept or confirm that friend request, okay? Then we're always gonna ask people to subscribe and click on notification bell. Okay, that's how we add subscribers to our YouTube channel. Okay, now, the uh, next thing you do is you're going to check the presentation aspect of this. All right, so what we're going to do is go back up to the top. Now we're back at the top. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here. And we're going to click on present. Okay, notice how this is now in a presentation uh, format. And we're just going to go through each slide and check how they are. And in the future, I'll be putting a screen right down here. And okay, there's the first one, 
next, 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 do the next one, next, next, next. Okay, and then we switch the, uh, uh, the topic up here from customer to builder. All right, each slide loads exactly as I want. I keep some space open here for my screen later. Okay, there we go. And there's the final slide just before we go to uh, this one, which is asking them to connect with us on Facebook. All right, I'm going to have the information here. And some people might want to put their Facebook address here. It's up to you. If you want to make that clickable, that's kind of maybe an advanced step. I just put it down in the description of the YouTube video. All right, now this is phase one of setting up the text for your slides, right? And then checking the presentation uh, aspect of your slides. In the next video, we'll go to phase two and I'll be adding some uh, images in here and still not have my screen in here. The next phase is just images added to this. Then phase three will be the images with myself in the screen, and that will be what I consider the final product. Thank you for watching, and see you in phase two.